why does my baby have personhood only after a certain point but not right now? It doesn't. Like, it it's... Does it, doesn't? it doesn't. It doesn't have... My baby right now in my belly does not have personhood. No, not quite yet. So when does my baby become a person? When it's born. Your friends are signing a petition over there. I'll sign too. You'll sign too? It's, uh, it's to put an amendment on the ballot to kind of undo Ron DeSantis's six-week abortion ban. Was that, is that something you oh, would sign? Don't even get me started on the abortion ban. Well, I want to hear about that. Are you kidding me? Yeah. We're already rolling. Tell me about... Abortion is health care. Like, mm -hmm. people need... It's not going to help the community for women to not get health care that they need. Okay. It's really important to be able to go to a doctor and take care of something that is going to affect your life in that way. So when you say take care of something, what is the something that they're taking care of? An unwanted pregnancy. Okay. It's important to, and gender affirming care is really important as well. Yeah. So for, it's, for children or for anybody? Anybody. 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 Yeah. But it's, if you take that right away from women, they're just going to go do dangerous stuff to try to get rid of an unwanted pregnancy and that can kill people. So. This petition is specifically against the six-week abortion ban. When do you think that ban should start? What limit do you think? Mm, let me think about it. I guess... I mean, you are just finding out you're pregnant at six weeks, like 90% of the time. So it's not... Um, I would say, that's a good question. Oh, I look dumb right now. No. I feel dumb right now. No, if um, you've never thought about it, then I've you don't have really an opinion, and that's that. okay. Yeah, I don't really have an opinion, just whenever it has been, like, because it's been federally legal for so long. Like, if it's not viable, then they should be able to do it. Okay, so at 21 weeks is about the point of viability that you're talking about, and that seems to be a popular answer among right. pro-choice advocates. So before point of viability, why do you think that it's okay to commit an abortion then, but not after that 21-week mark? What happens at that 21-week mark? Because if you can have the ability, like, they don't have the ability to live on their own mm -hmm. without the mother's body. Yeah. And that's the most important thing is, like, our bodies matter. Yeah. It's really important to, we're not just incubators for babies, you know? So I think it's important to be able to make your own decision about your body and your health care. If the fetus cannot survive outside of your body, then you should be able to do what you want because it's your body. It's not, it doesn't belong to a fetus that you're pregnant with until the baby's born. Okay. So I'm pregnant right now. I'm 14 weeks along. Um, praise God for this baby in my, in my belly. Absolutely. So why does my baby have personhood only after a certain point, but not right now? It doesn't. Like, it it's... Does doesn't? It doesn't. It doesn't have... My baby right now in my belly does not have personhood. No, not quite yet. So when does my baby become a person? When it's born. So what am I pregnant with if it's not a person? A fetus. Do you know what fetus means? Well, like a baby. Like it is a baby, but it can't live outside of you yet. Right. You're like giving it life right now. Yes. You it, are. Yes. And I will continue to up yes. until they're probably 18 years old right. because babies can't live without anybody, a mom, a dad, anybody taking care of them. Um, I just wonder, I'm asking the question today, I hear a lot that personhood starts after a certain point. So I'm just wondering, when does my baby in my belly become a person and become a human? I mean, it's a human from the, I don't know, I don't know. I've never really thought about that before. No? No. Okay. Do you think I'm pregnant with a person? I mean, yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah. So do you think people deserve to be killed, aborted, or murdered? No. So wouldn't that apply to the person in my belly? No, because it's inside of you. Right. So location doesn't matter. I mean, it does if you're the one who's 
gotten an umbilical cord and blood and is giving it life right now. Right, but I also sustain my babies by giving them food. I also have a toddler. I, I, I give him food. Yeah, but it's I not give coming him water. directly from your body. And your my blood. body is giving it. I also breastfeed my, my toddler, yeah. so I also am sustaining life that way. I just wonder when truly is the point if we're dictating personhood and point of viability because babies, boy, they are demanding up until, yeah. oh my gosh, teenagers, I assume. I don't have a teenager, but that's what I assume. So I've heard a lot that they're not babies, they're not people up until a certain point. So I do have a person in my belly. Yeah. And people don't deserve to be murdered. I mean, I feel like that's oversimplifying it. I don't think abortion is a hard issue. I don't either. You can't tell me if it's a person in here or not, and if they deserve to live. I mean, that's your choice. Okay. All right. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you.